The Taliban is in control of Afghanistan. The country's president has fled, and Western countries are scrambling to get people out. And this took the US by surprise. By the morning of Monday the 16th, the issue was not whether the Taliban was in control, it was. The immediate issue was the airport, as thousands of Afghans tried to get out. Extraordinary and harrowing footage emerged of people desperately trying to get onto planes, of US helicopters being used to clear people from the runway, and of people chasing one US plane down the runway while others clung to the fuselage. This is part of the news from August of 2021 in Afghanistan, and unfortunately this is what most people associate Afghanistan with. After three years from this news, we decided to visit Afghanistan. And, and this, this is, is our, our journey. journey. At the moment we are in uh, Bird Market, one of the oldest streets in Kabul. <laughs> so this is our first good day in Afghanistan. We're currently on our way to the road from Kabul to take us around three and a half to five hours to get there. Uh, we will be stopping along the way so we'll show you the way We are now in Bamyan and these are the Russian tanks which were left here by the Russians when they left in the 1980s. This is the Red City and this is the incredible view behind us. We're in Bamiyan, Afghanistan. Uh, this is the location where the statue of the Buddha used to stand. Unfortunately, it was destroyed in 2001 and this is what that's left. Basically, there is the foot of the original statue of the Buddha, but other than that, it's unfortunately destroyed, and this is what's left.
after four hours drive from uh, Bamiyan to Kapul, now we arrived in Babur Garden. 